point right. he's been making. Right. Yeah. There's just an opinion that you got. Right. But how can you, how can I be? Floyd Mayweather, a name synonymous with boxing greatness, recently found himself at the center of a heated controversy after accusing Gervonta Tank Davis of deliberately avoiding a potential bout with Shocker Stevenson. This accusation, made during an Instagram live session, has sparked intense debate within the boxing community and added another chapter to the ongoing tension between Mayweather and Davis, who was once under Mayweather's promotional wing. The controversy began when Davis suggested that Mayweather was more interested in exhibition matches such as his recent fight against John Gotti IV because he feared tarnishing his perfect 15-0 record. According to Davis, if Mayweather were truly confident in his abilities, he would pursue professional bouts with real stakes rather than engaging in what Davis dismissed as glorified sparring sessions. This assertion struck a nerve with Mayweather, who has always prided himself on his undefeated record, a feat few in the sport have ever achieved. Mayweather, known for his strategic acumen both inside and outside the ring, quickly responded on social media, refuting Davis's claims. He argued that it was Davis, not him, who was avoiding the toughest competition available, namely, a potential fight with Shocker Stevenson, another rising star in the lightweight division. Mayweather's fiery response suggested that he was genuinely upset by the notion that Davis might be surpassing him in terms of reputation or popularity. Since hanging up his gloves in 2017 after his victory over UFC star Conor McGregor, Mayweather has kept his name in the headlines through a series of high-profile exhibition bouts. These matches, while not counting toward his official record, have allowed Mayweather to maintain his brand and continue generating significant income. One of the most talked-about exhibitions in recent years was his bout against John Gotti IV, the grandson of the infamous mob boss John Gotti. The fight, held in Sunrise, Florida, attracted considerable attention due to the Gotti family's notorious legacy, though the match itself received mixed reviews. Davis, however, argues that Mayweather's focus on these exhibition matches is a strategic move designed to protect his undefeated record. In Davis's view, Mayweather is more concerned with preserving his legacy than with proving his greatness in the ring. He believes that if Mayweather were truly interested in challenging himself, he would have pushed for their match to be a professional one with real stakes and real risks. Davis's assertion that Mayweather is avoiding genuine competition to maintain an illusion of invincibility has resonated with some fans and critics alike. The notion that Mayweather might be more concerned with legacy than with competition is not entirely new. Throughout his career, Mayweather has been known for carefully selecting his opponents, often choosing fighters who posed a minimal threat to his unbeaten record. While this strategy has undeniably contributed to his success, it has also led to criticism from those who believe that Mayweather has avoided the toughest challenges available to him. Conor McGregor, who shared the ring with Mayweather in what became one of the most lucrative fights in boxing history, has also weighed in on the debate. According to McGregor, Mayweather's focus on exhibition matches is more about convenience than competition. McGregor suggested that after their fight, which marked Mayweather's 50th professional win, the boxing legend lost his appetite for real competition. The UFC star speculated that the challenge of facing him took something out of Mayweather, leaving him hesitant to risk his undefeated records in a serious bout. For McGregor, it's disappointing to see a fighter once hailed as one of the greatest now opting for less demanding bouts instead of stepping into the ring for real, meaningful fights. McGregor's comments reflect a broader sentiment among some fans and observers who feel that Mayweather's recent activities do not align with the image of a true champion. The idea that Mayweather might be avoiding real challenges to protect his legacy has led to questions about whether his focus on exhibition matches is diluting his status as one of the greatest boxers of all time. Mayweather's decision to engage in these exhibition matches can be traced back to his business acumen. 
Over the years, Mayweather has built an empire aptly named the Money Team and has become one of the wealthiest athletes in the world. His exhibition bouts, which often feature unique matchups against non traditional opponents, have allowed him to continue earning substantial sums without risking his unblemished record. These matches have included everything from facing Japanese kickboxer Tenshin Nasukawa to YouTuber Logan Paul, each drawing significant pay-per-view numbers and media attention. Despite the financial success of these events, critics argue that they lack the competitive spirit that made Mayweather a legend in the first place. To them, these exhibitions are little more than spectacles designed to capitalize on Mayweather's name without offering any real challenge or advancing the sport of boxing. This criticism has been amplified by Davis's recent comments, which suggest that Mayweather is more interested in maintaining his brand than in proving himself against the best the sport has to offer. Mayweather, for his part, has dismissed these criticisms, arguing that his decision to participate in exhibition matches is a smart business move. He has repeatedly stated that he has nothing left to prove in the sport, having already defeated some of the biggest names in boxing, including Oscar De La Hoya, Manny Pacquiao, and Canelo Alvarez. For Mayweather, these exhibitions are a way to continue making money and staying relevant in the public eye without putting his legacy on the line. However, Davis's comments have reignited a long-standing debate within the boxing community about what it means to be a true champion. To some, a champion is someone who continually seeks out the toughest challenges, regardless of the risk to their record. To others, a champion is defined by their ability to win and maintain their legacy, even if that means avoiding certain opponents. Mayweather's career, with its mix of carefully selected fights and high-profile exhibitions, embodies this tension. Davis, who has built a reputation as a fearsome knockout artist, represents the next generation of boxers who are hungry for success and willing to take on all comers. His criticism of Mayweather suggests that he views the older fighter's approach as outdated and overly cautious. Davis's willingness to call out Mayweather publicly despite their past relationship indicates a desire to carve out his own legacy, separate from his former mentor's shadow. The potential fight between Davis and Stevenson, which Mayweather has pushed for, represents a clash of two of the sport's brightest young stars. Stevenson, known for his slick boxing skills and high ring IQ, would present a significant challenge for Davis, who relies more on power and aggression. A bout between the two would not only be a major event in the boxing world, but also a chance for Davis to prove that he is willing to take on the toughest challenges, just as Mayweather did during his prime. Mayweather's accusation that Davis is ducking Stevenson has added fuel to the fire of this potential matchup. If Davis is indeed avoiding the fight, it could suggest that he is more concerned with maintaining his undefeated records than with proving himself against the best in the division. On the other hand, if Davis does take the fight and wins, it could silence his critics and solidify his place as the top dog in the lightweight division. The public nature of this feud between Mayweather and Davis has only heightened the anticipation for what comes next. Fans are eager to see whether Davis will rise to the challenge laid out by Mayweather.